What's the deal, my people? Teflon in the building with another Game of Thrones Season 8 video. And with 49 days to go until the new season of Game of Thrones starts, HBO has blessed us with another teaser promo type of trailer, giving us all the new shows that are coming out for HBO. And in this, we get a few scenes from Game of Thrones Season 8. We do get some footage that is from the upcoming season, and I think we get some footage that's from last season. Is it a lot? No, it's not. Do I wish it was more? Of course I do. But I'm a freak like that. And if you're a freak like me, then you know how I'm feeling. But I am happy of what we got, and I do think that it's enough for us to break down. And that is exactly what we're going to do. We're going to break down this footage that we got from Game of Thrones in this trailer, and I'm going to tell you exactly what I think is going on in it. Now, the clips that we get still look like it's from the first episode. It looks like it's from Daenerys arriving at Winterfell. That's the new stuff that we get. Now the other stuff that we get, it looks like it's from season 7, but still we may be able to draw some things from it, you know. We may be able to piece a couple of things from it because it's just a couple of characters that they're showing and why are they showing these characters and why are they showing these characters in this order. We can break it down that way. But the first footage that we do see, without a shadow of a doubt, is from what the stuff that we have already seen and that is Daenerys arriving at Winterfell. So let's break it on down. There's something in the air. Now we start off with a shot of the wall. I don't know if this is new or if this is from last year. I hope that it's new. It looks like it could be new. There's nothing special about this shot. All we do see is a bunch of ravens. So that would mean that Bran is over here. Hopefully, if this is new, this is Bran and he's seen exactly what happened when the Night's King has come through the wall. And that's what this vision is all about. And it's going to flash back to Winterfell and he's going to let them know that the Night's King has a dragon and he's heading that way. Next, we see the Unsullied and I believe that this is them arriving at Winterfell. When we look at the background, we can see it's very snowy. We can see that their arms are fully closed. Uh, we never really seen their arms covered up like that and I think it's because they are arriving at Winterfell and we can see that the dragons are arriving at Winterfell too and that basically sets up a money shot for this whole damn teaser because seeing the unsully that's nice i mean i enjoy seeing the unsully army just like everybody else i'm gonna enjoy them going to winterfell and i'm going to enjoy seeing the northmen interact with the unsully themselves i wonder if they show and the northmen interact with the dothraki how is that going to show down i wish they showed that social breakdown but this is it and this is it this is what i'm looking for in the trailer the awe that i'm seeing in Arya stark's face and there's no doubt that what this girl is looking at is drogon she's looking at the dragon arriving at winterfell and why wouldn't she be so happy? We're talking about a girl who named her direwolf after Princess Nymeria. Princess Nymeria is the person that inspired Arya Stark to want to become a warrior. It wasn't nobody from the north. It wasn't no legendary northern woman that made her want to become a warrior. That made Arya Stark want to become a warrior. A warrior so why wouldn't Arya Stark be in awe and I love her facial expression because she just looks like a little kid once again in this and as for the Danny John relationship there's no doubt Arya is gonna be down with that because she's got to be down with that because Arya is a type chick that she's just gonna want to ride on that dragon and I think she's gonna and that's what I want to see this upcoming season and let me know in the comment section do you think that Arya Stark is going to get on the dragon and ride dragon I think so let me know in the comment section if you think so also 
Now, unless the nice king is taking aim again, unless he's getting his revenge of the nerd Jamar on again, this is from last season. All these shots that we're seeing right here. But it's funny that the people that they're showing in these clips, because we see the Night King, we see the Night King's dragon, and then we see Daenerys Targaryen. Right after that, we see another picture of the Night King's dragon flying overhead and then Jon Snow. This looks like the shot that Jon Snow says you don't understand. And then we see the Night King's dragon flying over again and then Tormund. And after that we see the wall come down. So that's where I think we're going to start the season. I think we're going to start the season with the aftermath of the wall coming down. We might see Bran, those shots that we've seen in the beginning looking at everything that happened and then they come back to Winterfell he'll tell Sam Tarly or something like that what's going on and then after that Daenerys will arrive at Winterfell I think that's how we're going to start the season what do you think people let me know in the comment section I'm sure I missed a lot this is going to be quick because I'm going to do a live stream so make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so that you're notified every time I drop a new Game of Thrones video. Peace and stay sexy.